first time that I kayak, I I don't remember what it was. Well, my parents own a rafting company on the Ottawa River. We got into it mainly a family sport right away. My dad was already a pro kayaker. So I got into kayaking doing a slalom program in Atlanta, Georgia. So I didn't kayak until I went to college. I had no skirt, I had no life jacket, no helmet, no nothing. I just, I was just so excited to go out in that boat. Like moving into an RV so that we could always be together and my dad would be all the kayak. And I stopped kayaking when I was like 14 because I get super into the football. I, I didn't really like it for a long time. I was like, super scared. And I fell in love with the sport and uh, I hadn't, I had not stopped since then. I don't know, somehow I just caught the bug. And, I don't know, just never stopped. I think it has affected my lifestyle dramatically. I've been um, basically living nomadic for the last four years, so I'm like constantly traveling. Yeah, I guess I'm quite far behind with my friends and like, education. That makes it pretty difficult to either have a job, relationships, or work. So I'm kind of um, constantly battling to find that balance. When I was 20 though, I knew that I had to study something to have a backup plan if something happens. I went to college and then after college I worked for a year and I, then I decided to go back to university for my masters. I used to wake up at 6 in the morning to go battling and then university. So then I was sitting there in the university and they be like, you guys have no idea where I've been. <laughs> Whatever, I'm happy and I get to travel to all these amazing places and I learn lots like, traveling and meeting different people. And, uh, it seems that it always works out and pans out for the best so I, I love every minute of it and I love traveling so it works out really well for me. Sometimes I've been thinking like do I want to keep pushing it as hard as I am or do I want to like keep uh, being, doing other things you know, or start doing other things you know. But um, then, when cool things happen, you realize that uh, it's the price that we agree to pay, you know, with the river. It didn't actually happen to me, but what, like my best friend passed away on the river, and that was like all of our friends. We sort of we thought like why we kayaked and like, why we're pushing it so hard and like what happened to him. So, I don't know, but for me, what came out of that is that like kayaking made him happy and kayaking makes me happy and I'm gonna keep doing it. And I'm all, almost, honestly like kayaking harder than ever because of what happened, so. When one of your friends die, you're like, um, you're like, fuck, like, darling, you're like, fuck, if I wanna die somewhere, I wanna die here. Uh, there were like three, four days where I really, went over and over again and uh, I knew that it was what I wanted to do and uh, I was not going to quit it just because I got terrible. The best experiences I've had is like just out with the boys on a good run and you know when you're uh, amongst it and you know just living life and you know, kayaking is uh, you know it's everything to me so I, I really enjoy it and try to go as much as I can. Mentally for me kayaking is just the ability to be in a place that most people don't get to go and what you get to see you just you don't get experiences like that in many other places. I think that's what keeps me coming back is that trying to find the thing that has made me the happiest in my life. There are hard moments but uh, it's our lifestyle so other people don't, doesn't understand that you know. My pool, but uh. Um, what was the other part of that question? Um, uh, challenges. Challenge, yeah. Whenever you're ready. Um, uh, <laughs> so you ask me questions. Kayaking definitely affects my lifestyle. Um, I've be kind of, I've become. Sorry. Uh, first time that I kayak, I. I don't remember what it was. <laughs> so kayaking has perfected. Kayaking has affected my lifestyle dramatically. 
I you can just start talking about, okay, about how uh, I grew up River Raft badass high school degree but I didn't 